I'm Joni Smith, and I'm a professor in the Department of Theatre Arts and Dance. I teach in what's called the core curriculum. Those are the courses that the faculty have decided are the absolute ball of knowledge that one needs, and I teach in that core curriculum at the more advanced level. I'm really fortunate in the way that I get to interact with my students because my students are choreographing. It's a very vulnerable thing to be doing, to make a piece of art and put it up there in front of people. I get to interact at the instant of creativity and I try very hard to make this a good experience because it's really kind of scary. My students will be doing maybe their second or third piece of choreography, I will be doing my 100th. But we all go through the same things all along the way. We all have to teach our steps to other people. We have to show our dances. We have to find some way to costume them. We have to get them on stage. We have to light them. It's all the same process, no matter where you are in that whole continuum. What students can do while they're at the university is have all this studio space and their friends are dancing for them. It's a period of incredible investigation and you get exposure to every kind of technique. What do you think of jazz? What do you think of release technique? What do you think of ballet? Sometimes I talk about it like a, an artist would have a palette of colors. I say get all the colors you can get and then ultimately if you decide you only want to be fuchsia with a few days of aqua, Great. I'm a choreographer. I have a dance company, a professional company named Shapiro and Smith Dance. And it is peopled, I would say 90% by former students from the University of Minnesota. The other thing I do is I direct the spring concert, which is a combination of faculty, student, and guest artist works. Studying dance at the University of Minnesota is extraordinary. We have special funds where we can bring in very well-known and renowned choreographers, dance artists, dance educators, and dance scholars. It's rare anywhere in this country that you get that sort of exposure to people that are at the top of their field. We're pretty unique and pretty fabulous.